I know you're gonna dig this. Down here. Yes, we do. <laughs> What's going on everybody? How are you doing today? So here I am in Oshawa, Ontario, and I'm doing the film locations for a movie called Largo. Have you heard of it? Jessica, my friend, have you heard of the movie Largo? Yeah. <laughs> is it also known as something else? Yes, it's also known as It. Chapter? Two. And one it was called, right? Yes. Show me what you're holding there, Jessica. I have a water bottle that only the cast and crew of It Chapter Two received. So you only got this water bottle if you worked on the set. And you kind of did work on the set, didn't you? Yes, I did. <laughs> Why? Because I live very close to where they shot the Pennywise's house. Yes. Pennywise's house is right here, right beside us. And Jessica and her family and her two big dogs, one of which is only fed once a week. So if you come on their property, better hope you don't meet that dog. <laughs> no, they're both fed, but they're big dogs. So if you're gonna come on here and take a picture, just be careful. <laughs> Jessica has put, I, I filmed, I filmed you a week ago when I met you, right? Yeah. About a week and a half ago for it, chapter two. And we did a lengthy interview. And then I thought, this is too good for, for my chapter two regular video. We gotta do a separate one featuring just you. <laughs> because you have so much stuff to yeah. do with this it, chapter. You have props, you have yes. signed memorabilia. You have, um, the books are what kills me. This is incredible what you're gonna see. What this young lady has done, it's really cool. And you want a career in filmmaking, right? Yeah. You're like already like beyond. Get your, your degree. You've got it. You're giving, I'm giving it to you right now. I have no authority to do that. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> but you should have one already. Well, let's walk around the property and tell me a few things about this, okay? So here's where the house stood. I showed this on my last video of It Chapter 2 and It Chapter 1. Tell me about it. So this is the property where they filmed Pennywise's house where you will be walking about. Now, if you went straight on, yep. is where you would go through Pennywise's little 29 Bolt Street gate you can see in the movie. Right, right about here, right? Uh, yes. So you'd walk through that, and as you would keep going straight, you would end up through the pathway up to the steps of the house, just a little bit over a little hill here. And right about here is where you would start walking up the stairs into onto the porch of, right. the, of the house. So right here is where the porch would have been. Yes. You're standing on. So you would have your porch here and about around this little area here would be your door. Right. And then you had your porch. The house was probably about to the fire hydrant and that. And the fire hydrant, which is seen in the film, yes. heavily dressed for, uh, for Nebel Street. And then how far back did the house go? Right around here. Day. Is there anything left on the property? Have you have you checked? See if there's anything left behind? There's nothing left behind. Nothing, eh? They they did pretty good. <laughs> and they constructed the house twice. Yes, they did. They tore it down after the first one. Yes. And then the second one they built they built it again, but less. Yes. The second time they only built the porch of the house and they built a bunch of scaffolding and they green screened all right. the sides. Right. And the first one, they, but they built an entire facade, front sides, right? The whole facade. So you have the whole front house, and then you'd have this whole side strip here. Right. Was completely built, and you even have Pennywise's back porch be about over there, around here. That was all yeah. built. <laughs> so you, Jessica just informed me that you see Pennywise's back porch in the first one. I haven't seen the first one in about a year, and I actually saw it about 10 times just to do all my filming locations, but I cannot remember a damn thing. But yeah, they, you see his back porch and right across the street, the sun is coming right at us, but that, there was a fence put up, right? An old chain link fence. Yes, an old chain link fence that they made to look old. It was actually brand new. It was brand and then, new, a brand new fence and they made it look oh, yeah. old. Yeah. Brand new, shiny, brand new fencing. And then they ran it over and just- Ran it over, what do you mean? Oh yeah, they took their um, bobcats and everything that they're using to build the house with and they just ran it over. Really? They just 
destroyed it. <laughs> people, you sit there and people would like just bang at it with hammers and everything. Wow, how long did that take? It took them probably just about a day to do it. Wow. It didn't take very long. <laughs> So we're standing right where the prop where the house was on the property and there's a few other things I was saying before in the second one you do see these exact cracks on the road right here I hate the sun today but you see these cracks here where he drops his bike and the lamp the light you said they put a fake one right here correct yeah, they put a fake lamp post right about the edge of the sidewalk over there and they did have a sidewalk but it was all Bristol board. Sidewalk coming right along here? Yeah, so as you, you can see the sidewalk ends. Yeah, because you do and see a bit of this sidewalk. Yeah, so they actually, for the first one, they brought in Bristol board and they made it look like a sidewalk. Right to this so fire hydrant, <laughs> right? Yes, sorry, you were saying? And no one I was actually allowed to step on the Bristol board because if they stepped on it, it would break. Yeah. And everyone thought it was a real sidewalk, so. So did they have a sidewalk wrangler? Somebody saying, don't step on that. Don't yep. step. I bet they did, right? <laughs> and they probably made more money. Than, well, let's. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, yes, Jessica, you were living here for part one, part two. And not only did you get to watch the entire thing being filmed and you and you went to Port Hope. Yes. Where the cast and crew knew you. Yes. And you got, and you got the props. You got screening tickets, the whole thing. You also got to hang out with the cast of both films. Yes, I did. And, and the kids, you ate lunch, breakfast, dinner at a hotel with them. Oh, yeah. For how long? For three days. They stayed in a hotel for three days. And they actually walked off the top pool floor of the hotel. So since I was part of the movie crew, um, they also had me up there. So I actually went swimming with the cast. I got to know them a bit. So I got to meet all the kids, which is really fun. Yeah. And then for chapter two... Um, they didn't stay the night, but they did like about a twelve hour shoot. Yeah. Here and the when they when the cast was on break, they actually came over and just talked to us, which was really fun. Yeah, you met my hero, Bill Hader, correct? Yes. You met him a couple. So the first one, they spent a lot of time out here filming, but the second one, you're, you're, it was only like a day and a half. You said right? This, oh yeah. The shots with Eddie riding his bike, and then the adult kids, the adults going in. Yeah. That's it. That was that was it. They were here for a long time, just for a few scenes. Yeah, but the first one, they were here a lot. They were here for how long? How many days, do you think? They were here from about 7 in the morning till 6 at night, and they were here for three days. For the first one? Yeah. Oh, the first one was only three days? Yeah. Oh, I thought it was longer than that. <laughs> I thought you said longer. Okay, so now, and then, okay, so what's really cool is, well, I'm going to have to show. We're going to show you what is really cool, what you made. <laughs> yes. To show you exactly how they built this house what goes on behind the scenes of a major motion picture your favorite movie yes of course my second favorite movie after <laughs> friday 13th part two but still let's go take a look <laughs> so look at all, okay we're gonna get to all this memorabilia in a second but the main thing i want to show everyone you made two hardcover books yes about the filming and these are actual this is <laughs> this isn't some like you know junior high project here <laughs> right this is this is people want to buy this from you correct you've had um, so actually the director and the producer of the movie have both books same with the location manager who i met they have both books that i have made and i've actually been told by people in the adult cast of it they were very excited to be in my second book and they were wanting a book too uh -huh. so <laughs> well they got a pony up they're the ones with the money this is this is expensive stuff you've done here so this is from part one this is, this is part one you documented them building the house from start to finish yes this is how they did it so we started off with a lovely signature from Andy machete the director right uh, and he drew that oh yeah just wow stand there in the middle of the road just drew it yeah just he drew he drew that just on the middle of the road just, just like that, eh? Yeah. Oh, that's incredible. So there's a director. This is where my neighbor Jessica lives, and that's Pennywise saying it. <laughs> Let's float again. There we go. Same from the bottom. So you have the very beginning. They started like just placing out where they want the house to be. So that's that process. They came in, did more. This is the facade going up. Right. Because there was no inside to the house. Right. That was all done at the. Um, Pinewood Studios. <laughs> yeah. And well, no, in the first one, it's, it's the house on uh, Pape Avenue. Yeah. Uh, which I filmed a million times. Mm -hmm. I'll put in a quick little picture of that house right now where they did the insides. And I went out there again to do it for part two, but 
I didn't include it. But yeah, they shot there. So here's the house, yeah, scaffolding going up. So these walls went up. This is everything here. And then this is actually behind. So this is what it looked like right down here is what it looked like from the back of it. So yeah, it wasn't that glamorous in the back. <laughs> more of that you have that's the roof going up. right you that's use a crane to put that up yep oh wait what was this photo here oh that's amazing that's a great shot yeah and, and let's also be clear you took all these photographs yeah i took every photo that's every incredible. one every day at least one every day did you have a plan to document it into a book or did, did it just come up afterwards um we knew we wanted to do something we weren't sure what exactly, but we're like, let's take a picture every day. Type yeah, idea. great idea. And then we turned it into a book. This is the interview. Yep, so you were on the huge news. Huge interview. That's on YouTube also. <laughs> yeah. Shooting is expected to begin here next week. The Welters will be moving out for a few days to allow their home to appear abandoned. But they've been invited for a set visit and are enjoying all the excitement. I know it's going to be a really fun story to tell all my classmates when I go back to school. <laughs> Dude looks like Ryan Gosling. He's a, he's a, he's a Canadian newscaster. I don't know that guy. Oh yeah. He, he's he's based in this region. Yeah. I guess I just don't get that. Back <laughs> in Toronto. Okay. There's a roof going up. Yeah. Roof. More parts of the roof. <laughs> And then look at it come together just like that. And there's the house. I see that's that's how they What's the balloon? That balloon showed up one day in the field. I just kind of woke up and it was there. Do you know why? Do you know who put it there? I don't know who put it there. I just assumed because it was it. So I'm just like, you know what? <laughs> yeah. We'll take a picture. Yeah, of course. <laughs> so we had people come dress up. People were coming dress like this is not even during Halloween. No, this was middle of like August. People ish. came and just dressed up. <laughs> they dressed up and they, they came with excited. balloons, everything. So, this is the spout that was on. Wow. It's not shown very much in the movie. But, but look at the detail. There was plenty of detail on it. Yeah. And we put a red balloon in the. We got you security. Did that? We got security to put a red balloon in the window. That's so nice. And then. There it is. There's your window. There's Pennywise's back porch. Oh, so okay. This is the back porch. This is why I gotta watch it. Gotta see this scene. <laughs> that's crazy. And then that's your house fully done. Right. And then some old cars. Cars up on the road. This little truck was actually in our yard at one point. So <laughs> that was fun. That's who's that? That's me. <laughs> I had to dress up too. Of course. Yeah. And then you have your filming day. Right. So this was about, I would say, 7 in the morning. <laughs> 7 in the morning. And you were right there ready to go, huh? Oh, yeah. You're excited. So they were doing his Eddie's walking scenes. Okay. And they did it about five times in, on one day. Right. You have Pennywise's balloons. Some of the sunflowers. Right. right we're going to get to those sunflowers soon. How many sunflowers were planted? In the first one, there's probably about, I think it was 150. Right. So, I think that was the amount. So here's the, here's some of the, who's that? That's, a, that's the director. He looks a lot, he grew his hair out for the second, didn't he? Or he yes, looks a lot different. Yeah. That's the director, there's the kids. Yeah, those are their stunt doubles. I was just about to say, I was actually just looking, I was like, that doesn't look like that. So are these adults? No. Oh, they're actually other they're, kids. Sometimes, because you know, for kids, they can't work a certain amount of hours, right? They were all around the same age as them. But kids can only work about right. an hour or two yeah. in a movie, and then they have to switch. And they were doing their schooling and everything, so they would switch them out. So you have your real cast here and here, and then that's another stunt double. There's a stunt double. That's Bikes, crazy. and then you have your real cast here. That's right beside your house. Oh yeah, that's in my driveway. That's your driveway. <laughs> there's, there's the kids hanging out, and there's uh, oh, yeah. Bill as a young kid. I don't know his what's his name in real life. Jaden. Okay. <laughs> That's a cast photo when they were all here. Wow. Whoops. Look at that. That's very cool. And another one there. Hmm. Just some more pictures of the house. You got your fire hydrant there. There's the fire hydrant, which is still there. <laughs> it's real. It's real. 
<laughs> She's painted differently. <laughs> and there's the ending of that book. Yeah, and then you got signatures from chapter two cast. Right. That's you got. you got Bill Hader there, Trash Mouth. Oh or, yeah. Huh. Oh yeah. This was um the guy who played older Eddie. You have Bill. Barbara is the producer, and then you have a bunch of other like like key scene artists, like a bunch of other people. Right. <laughs> that's really cool. Okay, so let's see book number two. And then you have book number two. This was actually painted. You painted? This, you did this? Um, we actually had a friend do it. That's amazing. And this is on a piece of wood, like a shingle right. from the house. Oh, wow. So that's a little more information there. <laughs> so we started off with our first book. <laughs> yeah. And there's the property again. So they shot it. Both, both movies are shot over the course of a summer, correct? Yes. Each summer, yeah. So they start the same way. Everything. Yeah. The thing about the same is the beginning. Except they a bit, did it a bit differently. They didn't have scaffolding. This was their front porch. Well, I thought what was very interesting, what you told me last week, what's interesting is they rebuilt the house, but they were doing something, some a few things wrong, and you corrected them. Yeah. <laughs> There's actually a broken board above the porch. Right. And they were making the house and it wasn't broken. And I went outside and I talked to the crew who was building it. And I said, oh, I'm pretty sure there's a broken board. And I went out and got my first book. And they went through the f first book and their um, boss was actually there. And he looked through the book and he said, tear it down. Because you did it wrong. <laughs> <laughs> you got somebody. <laughs> you got someone in trouble. So it's more of the house right. there fire hydrant sunflowers so let me so now that we're talking about sunflowers mm -hmm. this is the sunflower from chapter one chapter one so they dug holes in the ground basically and just had to put them in this one is just small right but then this is from chapter two so. they dug them in deeper to make them the same size yeah so let's see mm -hmm. yeah this Crazy. one was actually beside the closest one to the fire hydrant, by the way. This is the closest one to the fire hydrant? Yeah, they actually let me pick it out. So I picked one closest to the fire hydrant and one closest to the porch. I'll give you a $2 Tim Hortons gift card for that. <laughs> no, thank you. Oh, well. Oh, well. <laughs> Joke's on you. <laughs> the gift card's uh, empty. Anyway. <laughs> so you have the tree that was actually fake. It was made out of, like, styrofoam. Wow. And then you have your porch, cars. There's your lamppost that was actually. Yeah, and it's actually straight. funny that you call it my lamppost because I am kind of somewhat obsessed with this lamppost. <laughs> <laughs> it was right. It was right here, right? I keep go going through. It was right there, right? Yeah. Right there, because this one you see in the background in the second one. I'm not sure about the first. But the second one you definitely see it when Bill's uh, driving the, uh, on his bike. <laughs> And then there's your little... So there's where you corrected them on that one, right? Yes. That, that board right there. It was... They had it They had it solid going across. Yeah. So then you got nice your little... Nice catch. <laughs> then you, they actually build an, an inside right. for the second one. It was just two little doorways. But they had newspaper and everything. So I got to go in there. And then there's your porch... Right. And all of this, all this blue, was tarped green screen. That was all green screen. Yeah. All around to make it a bigger house, right? Yes. Because all they built was this. Yeah, that was it. That's it. That's it. That was it. And then, like, sunflowers and grass. And then there's your cast, like, walking yeah. around there. Where's Bill? I don't see Bill. Is that him? That's back there. That's the... him. Yeah. Is Bill there? Aww. Yeah. Got and yeah, Eddie. Young when Eddie. He's, young, he's right, right. He's McAvoy there. Mm -hmm. That is the director on riding one of the kids' bikes. Oh, or yeah. Eddie's bike, yeah. Yeah, he huh. just rode around a lot. Yeah. Great shots of this of the cast. So is it he, in the movie? He's wearing the red shirt, correct? Yes. So that's him just practicing before him. Yeah. Nice. Mm -hmm. James McAvoy on on silver. Yeah. And there's the director with James McAvoy, Jessica Chastain. Is this is this this would be after they fought Pennywise, correct? Yeah. She's a little, yeah, <laughs> worse for they're the all a little like dirty up, and yeah. everything. So, that's our night shots that happened at like 2 a.m., right? And that would be that lot right there, correct? Yes, and it was a clear night sky, 
and they actually made it foggy. So the fog, everything you see, was just actually all, done. And all fog machines and everything, right? Oh, yeah. Huge ones, you said, right? Oh, yeah. The moon was actually made by spotlight sometimes, too. Oh, wow. So, and what's who, that. who's that? That's probably James McAvoy down there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> they and, had to spray down the road also. Yeah, to make to it make wet. To make it look like it rained. Yeah. And then this is the little trip to... Port Hope. Yeah. This is Mrs. Kirsch, the lady who plays Mrs. Kirsch. That's her signature. Nice. That was, that was a fun experience there. So you have Paul Bunyan, your regular... Great shot. Yeah. Your regular little main areas you would go visit. Yeah. If you've watched any of my it videos you've seen all of these locations but this is actually so you went to you saw it when it was dressed for the the drugstore when it was dressed for it which is incredible yeah and the stephen king the oddity shop that he ran mm -hmm. the hotel then you got your signs everything yeah there's your tree so cool and there's the house like a bigger picture of the house completed for chapter two right and then back here is the producer's signature. Let's see. Right there it is. That's the producer's signature? Yeah, just down here. Lots of love to my favorite. Oshawa family. Oshawa family. Oh. <laughs> Maybe gone, but I fear. We never know. It might be part three, right? You never know. <laughs> then you got a nice little picture of anyways on the back. <laughs> <laughs> now, one question I just thought of. Because I'm really smart. <laughs> or maybe Jessica reminded me. She actually met Bill Skarsgård, who plays Pennywise. Tell me about that, Jessica. So basically, I met I met Bill Skarsgård during Chapter 1. I didn't see him during Chapter 2, but I saw him during Chapter 1. Mm -hmm. um, In full Pennywise? Not full Pennywise. But it got kind of weird in a way. <laughs> I was... It was the day they were actually coming into the hotel. Mm -hmm. And I went out to the lobby and I was talking to a bunch of people. I went up into the elevator and this person came. He stands probably about like, he's tall. He's like six foot tall or something. Yeah. So everyone on the sixth floor was part of the crew. So he started talking to me and asking me who I was. I told him, oh, I'm basically like, oh, I'm like your neighbor almost. Mm -hmm. And um, he told me who he played. And he actually did the lip in the eye thing while he was talking in the Pennywise voice to me. He, he talked to you in the Pennywise voice? Oh yeah, he did the eye thing and the like the weird lip thing. Did you ask him to or he just did it? <laughs> he, I asked him to and then he said my name in the weird Pennywise voice. Oh, like how he gosh. says like, hi Georgie. Yeah. He said it my name in it. That's but we crazy. were in an elevator, uh -huh. which was kind of like an enclosed space and you're like, um. <laughs> <laughs> that was a little creepy, huh? Yeah. <laughs> That's really cool though. That's, he was a really nice guy even though he's. Oh yeah. Terrifying. He's really nice. Yeah. <laughs> so show me this. This is what. This is another thing that's really cool. This is hanging up. So this is actually hanging up in Mike's like little office area. In part two. Say. It's kind of hard to see, and yeah. you have to really look for it. So where is this hanging? This is um, at the fun fair. Yeah. On I believe the gate and the fun house. And they just gave this to you, huh? Oh yeah, they just, I kind of asked for it. I hinted at them, I wanted it. <laughs> Quilt raffle, biggest <laughs> zucchini. This sounds like a fun fair. <laughs> That's really cool. So that was that. Those were like my main. And then I believe the characters Don and Adrian are playing a game and it's one of the yeah. prizes it's in the background. Little stuffed Aww. tigers. Very cool. And so a little tiger too. I gave you that too. Complete complete the collection yeah then you also have shirts i made this shirt so it's not really yeah. official but people have signed it who do we got we got bill Hader at the bottom bill Hader, james mcavoy you got your older eddie on here somewhere over here yeah <laughs> got isaiah and the director and the producer of the movie. so cool and then this shirt is actually a crew shirt. You can only get this shirt if you worked on the crew of the movie. So it was the set set designers and like the building team. Right. So they gave me a shirt. So cool. And then this hat is actually a locations hat. The location manager actually got me. Nice. Specifically ordered one for me, which was. Oh, that's really sweet. That was pretty nice. 
And this, oh yeah, I love this. Tell this, me about this. This is newspaper that is in the windows of, of the house. Of Petty Wise's house. It's, you don't really see it in the movie unless you pay attention to it. Right. But they did it all. They They're really actually dated 1922, 1922. I looked at this already. Maine. The attention to detail. They're all different pages inside. Oh yeah. And the last thing we have is your little, our little no trespassing sign. This was on, this was in the house? This was hanging on the fence outside of the house. This is the actual sign that's hanging on the fence. Yes, for chapter two. Right. This is a chapter two sign. So. It's so cool that you have that. <laughs> and this is right here is a piece of the house. A piece of the house. It's part of the wood. Scrap wood. Which is the part that was facing out. That'd yeah. be this one. This yeah. piece. Really cool. So it was a scrap piece of wood and they actually just let me have it. Nice. So that's, that's part of the house. So. It was actually brand new and as you can see it's not very, it yeah. doesn't look very new. They power washed it, torched it, anything to Crazy. think of. Crazy. Well, there we go. I've already done this. You can watch my first uh, video on it, chapter two, that I just put up not too long ago. And all the scenes shot right here with this fence. I mean, with <laughs> all the seas are right here. And you can see the difference here, the cracks here, the house here, the fence here. Watch my uh, first part of chapter two. The first video on part two. And then I got five videos on part one. <laughs> oh, it's exhausting. So, Jessica, thank you very much. <laughs> We're laughing a little bit. The house is protected by lights and sensors. Everything's going into a vault. Yeah. So, just so you know. But if you want to come by. still lives here. Be careful. Yes. I know him. Personally. Yes. Yeah, you do. Text me. <laughs> but all he did was yell clown. I thought he was dead. Clown, <laughs> clown, clown. That's all it took to kill him. After all of that. After four and a half hours. He protects me from the grave. Oh, oh, from the grave. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that makes sense. That makes sense. Can you do a Pennywise face? Oh, I can't. <laughs> I don't know how to do that. I've tried. It doesn't work out very well. <laughs> I'm going to try it. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to work on it. I was trying the voice. Uh, Oh, I can't remember the quote I was doing for underneath the baseball beat. Oh, I can't. I was, what was I, what did he say? Oh, Vicky? Vicky? Ah. Uh, <laughs> awkward. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll do it again sometime. All right. So, from the grounds of Painting White House, Jessica, thank you so much. I hope you have a lot of success. Thank you. With your thank career you for filmmaking. Having me. Yeah, this was fun. Thank you for doing this. And thanks to your mother and your father. They're right over there watching. And so is Pennywise. Jessica, give me a fist bump. All right. Peace. Bye. Out.